Boys, girls, cats, and squirrels, what is going on? My name is Light This Alton, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. How are y'all doing today? I hope y'all are doing great. Let's start off the video with a quick team recap. Last episode, we ended it by catching Rattled, our new Magikarp. We're going to check out his ability, but first, we've got Smashed the Mewtwo with White Smoke, Rock and Confusion, Disable and Barrier. Then we've got Kingdra, also known as Triggered, with Water Absorb, with Water Gun, Smoke Screen, Bubble, and Leer. Then we've got Coded the Porygon with the Sturdy Ability, with Tackle Conversion 2 and Conversion. And then we've got Magikarp with Splash. And with the ability, Guts. Not bad. Too bad he's not going to be used till he evolves into a Gyarados, unless we get a powerful TM. First things first, let's take off the Lucky Egg from Mewtwo and give that bad boy to Magikarp because we are going to be switch training this guy big time. Nobody really needs any grinding because besides Magikarp, because everybody else is a high level. Alright, to start things off, I also want to mention the new layout. So somebody uh, DM'd me and asked me what happened to the question of the day. How come it's not on layout? I just wanted to make to make the layout a lot more clean. I just wanted to make it more basic. Um, also, I kept forgetting to add the question of the day on the layout too. I kept forgetting to write it in. That was one reason too why I got rid of it. But like the main reason was I just wanted to make it more clean. Uh, you could find the question of the day in the comments down below. It always says it down there. So you could always go down there and check and it will tell you what it is. It's the first thing I put in the com uh, not in the comments, in the description of the video. The first line of the description is the question of the day. So yeah, definitely go and check that out. Uh, yeah, go check out the description, I guess. For the question of the day, if uh, if you forget what it was when you were listening to the video, which is generally kind of hard because I talk about it usually for the most part of the video, um, you could find in the first uh, line of the um, description. Yeah. But um, yeah. So in today's episode, I think we're going to take on Roxanne like live. We're going to enter her gym right now. Actually, what's the potion situation looking like? I got six. I got two. Do I need more? It might be a good idea, but you know what? Nah, I'm good. Maybe I'll take on the trainers, come back out, and get more, maybe. That could be a thing. But, um, yeah, I think we're good. Alright, first things first. Yeah, but we're gonna take on Roxanne, grab this gym badge, and then we're probably gonna go to, uh, oh no, we got some story stuff after Roxanne, and then we're gonna go to Duford. Um, if I had speed up, we'd probably take on two gyms in the same battle, in the same, uh, um, not the same battle, in the same episode. However, I don't think that's going to happen, sadly. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, but, so we should get to Duford. If we don't take, if we don't have enough time to take on the gym, then what will probably happen is... I'll probably just grab the encounters that we can that are around there. Like, you can get four encounters once you get to Duford. You pick up the rod, and you can get four. So that'll be sick. We could add more Pokemon to our team. That'll be, that'll be dope. Fun times, fun times. Two. Oh, I just made a big mistake. Not in the video, but like... I didn't plug my headphones in, so I'm not listening to the music. And I love listening to, like, the music when I'm recording. It feels so much better. Now it just kind of feels real awkward. Do I think I could leave Rattled in here? I think I can. I want to give him more XP. His nose pass is gone right now with one. Yep. And I don't think Vigoroth is going to do enough, enough to one-hit me. Who's coming in there? Bulbasaur. Okay. Scratch. Yeah, you splash. Splash. Water gun. 
So unless they double team me, then I should be fine. Bigger off gone. Ooh, that nice crit. Rattle should be gaining more levels right now. Yeah, eight. Beautiful. Triggered, 16. Nice, nice. What's next? A Cyndaquil. Ooh. Splash it up. You know what? Maybe Roxanne will give us a TM that we could teach to Magikarp. Now that I think about it. That'll be sick. That'll be sick. We could actually have Magikarp battle himself. If we can get a good TM on Magikarp and if then we could get a Flame Orb, <laughs> then I'd be really happy. The thing that sucks, though, is that his Guts ability ups his attack, but he's a special... Uh, well, I don't know if he's a special attacker, but he's water type. Is he a special attacker? Magikarp's a special attacker, or at least mine is. What's his ability? It could be because of the nature. I don't really know what natures do. I only know in, in the later games because it tells you with the blue and red. Um, so, yeah. But if we could get a good, yeah, with guts, I was gonna say we could, if we could get a flame orb, then we could teach it, uh, and we get a physical attack on it, we can have it go ham. However, he's a special attacker, so that kind of sucks. And so is water. Water special in this game, which sucks. I really like how in Gen Four they uh, came out with the better physical special split. Uh, I think that was like one of the best steps that Pokemon ever made. Uh, to improving their games was really splitting that Another best step that they made wasn't What was the first one that it was in was it heart cold and soul silver that it was the first one Was there walking Pokemon behind you in gold and silver no Heart gold and soul silver there were there was Pikachu in in uh, Pokemon yellow but yeah, I found walk Pokemon walking behind you. Really cool. Really sick. And then they got rid of it. And I don't understand why. And uh, I'm a little salty about that. I'm slightly salted about that. But uh, it's okay. It's okay. I can live without Pokemon walking behind you. Alright. Uh, actually, one thing one thing that I hate that they got rid of was... um. Well, I just had it and then I forgot. Oh, Mega Evolutions. I absolutely love Mega Evolutions and now they got rid of them. What the heck? Come on, Nintendo. Give me my Megas. What are they doing to me? Alright, we got Taylor versus Magikarp here. Now I'm going to have to swatch Rattled out. Swatch? Now I'm going to have to switch Rattled out because it's not a double battle. I can't just let him stay in there. I would have to struggle. I'd have to uh, use Splash until he struggles. And I don't feel like sitting here and wasting time. I want to get the video going. We're going to roll. I don't want to sit and struggle unless I have to. Oh, yeah. Waste all your potions right here. I'm down. Just keep on wasting them. Keep on wasting them. I think she has a second potion, so that kind of sucked. But we got rid of Taylor. That's one Pokemon down. You're about to send in Quagsire, that's okay, we're gonna go into Rattled. And then we're gonna swap it into Mewtwo to nail him with a powerful confusion. What's up, Quag? Meet Smashed. Smashed, do your thing. Oh, he tried to slam you. Oh. He's not a good boy. Bad Quag, bad Quag. Quagsire. Oh. Is it still gonna kill? I was about to make a pun. There's gonna be an Asteroid Mania videos pun essentially. I don't know if he's actually said the one that I was gonna say. Quagsire. More like Quag. See you later. Sire. See you later. I know it was bad. I'm sorry. Okay, it sucked, but it's okay. What mon are they sending in? I forgot to look. They are sending in a powerful... Ooh, a Latios. See, I would be a little afraid, but I've got smashed. So I'm not afraid. 
Um, so, how much do you guys hate me for that pun? I'm really sorry about it. I apologize. It was a bad pun. Oh, this confusion's doing nothing to this guy. Okay, let's let him use Psy Wave. I got a plan, I got a plan. Psy Wave, beautiful. And disable. And now you probably have nothing to attack me, right? Let's see, what are you gonna do? Safeguard, yep. He doesn't have anything to attack me now. I think Psy Wave is his only attacking move at level 15. I disabled it. You can't do anything to me. Just keep, keep using safeguard. Go ahead. What do you have? You have an Oran Berry. Wow. The plays. He popped out an Oran Berry on us. Ooh, the crit! Hey! Gonna keep going for them safeguards? Ooh, you're disabled no more. That's okay. One more confusion, and you're gone, and your side wave ain't doing anything to me. Actually, you're doing you're doing a decent chunk. If I didn't have disable, this could be a very different get battle. I'd have to potion stall. Well, not potion stall, but I'd have to let him like, I'd have to get him down and then heal myself up. And wouldn't really be a potion stall because potion stall is usually when you have to toxic them and then just keep poisoning, just keep potioning. Oh, I just cracked my back. Well, that's it. We beat Roxanne, and we are getting our badge. Let's add that to the layout. That was a really bad snap. I don't know if you guys were even able to hear that snap. I think you would have been able to. It was also a really shitty snap, so I think it was a proper snap. It teen spider web. Oh, come on, Roxanne. I wanted powerful TMs. It's all good. I still have a chance. If I go through the cave, I could still probably get a... I'll still get a, um... TM through Steven. Yeah, but spiderweb sucks. Spiderwebs just keep, uh, it... It's like an arena trap. It doesn't allow the Pokemon to leave. So that's kind of useless. Especially in this, uh... In a, in a regular Nuzlocke. It's useless. Nobody swaps out. There's only one trainer that I've ever seen swap out so much in my life. And that was from one of the episodes of the Lost 4 recordings. There was a guy that swapped his Pokemon out like seven times. But, um, yeah, generally they don't swap out their Pokemon. So we're not keeping this. We're going to sell this right now. We are going to sell it for a couple more potions. Oh, no, wait. I was about to sell them. I'm like, why isn't it letting me buy more than two? I was so confused. Yeah, because I should be able to buy seven, but I'm not going to buy seven. I'm going to buy three. I'm going to buy three super potions, more Pokeballs, and more Pokeballs. Yep. One more potion. And then I should be good. Alright, now let's go get back the Devon goods and Pico and anything else we need to do. Look at this boy run. We are so speedy. Yeah. Tell me about the goods. You need the goods. I'm going to save you your butt before your boss fires you. Don't you worry. I think there's a trainer still up here that I haven't fought yet. Did we fight? No, we did not. We. Yeah, so this will probably take me about maybe, what, three minutes? get down there battle him and come back so we depending on what uh what my levels are when we get to Duford, i know there's only like one more battle that we have to do we might take on the gym actually i might take on the gym before i do the uh before i do what was i gonna say before i do what um, 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 
Oh, yeah. Might take on the gym before I do the whole Steven stuff, and before I do the encounters. Uh, the gym might be the play. Because, like, I'm level 16 across the board now. Almost, not across the board, but, like, I'm 16 with Kingdra, and I think I'm 17 with Mewtwo, right? 11 with Rattled. Rattled's not really doing much, but that's okay. Uh, so I think I might take on the gym. I think that could be a cool thing to do. Take on the gym, get two gym battles in one episode. I think that would be hype. You guys would probably love to see that. Um, and yeah, so I think that's what we're going to do. That's going to be the play. Alright, level 11, level 11 Sableye. And like, our levels are good. Our levels are decent. It's not a level booster. When we get to the gym, the gym's going to have, I think his highest level is a level 19. And we can train up inside the gym. Against the uh, trainers, so we should be good. Look, we were over leveled for this gym, so next gym we would probably be, we'll be on, it will be pretty much on par. We even be a little lower leveled, but uh, yeah. So I think that will be interesting. Let's do that. We're gonna go battle May. And then we're going to head to um, Duford and take on the gym. If the lock gets lost right here, that's going to be so sad. That's going to be so sad. I'm going to be so sad. I'm going to be I'm going to be slightly salted because we're losing in episode. What? What is this? Three? Yeah, this is three. This is episode three because I've already done episode two. Um, episode two's already actually edited, so that's sick. We are actually ahead of the game because right now it is Monday and I am recording Friday's episode, and then I'm gonna record next Monday's episode too. So I'm gonna have a week of episodes ready to go after today. I might even record Wednesday's episode today. Who knows how I'm feeling? Because, like, the thing about me recording episodes is I don't like to record stuff when people are home because I don't have a door to my room, and right above me is the living room. So like my mic picks up all background noise so you'd be able to hear my parents in the living room all the time so i don't like recording when people are home so i have to record when people aren't home right now my car is broken down so i ended up not going to school today so i'm recording so generally i record on thursdays because thursdays i don't have school i've made my schedule so i don't have school on thursdays which is sick so thursdays is like my recording day but like if i I ever can't record on Thursdays and that kind of sucks so like uh, this past Thursday I couldn't record because people were home so that sucked so like episode 1 and 2 were recorded um, when were they recorded episode 1 was recorded on Friday because I had a pet day on Friday not a pet day I had my school closed um, I forget why my school closed but my school closed on Friday and then um, I was home, but I wasn't home alone. My little brothers were home. So when they were outside playing street hockey, I recorded an episode. And then I also recorded an episode Sunday. Sunday when everybody was at hockey. Everybody had, ho had hockey practice. So I recorded the episode before I left for my brother's hockey game. And yeah. And even then, I wasn't home alone. My girlfriend was here. She was just being quiet. Even when I asked her, even when I told her she could talk. But yeah, I was going to bring her into the episode, but it didn't seem like she was interested. That's okay. Maybe one day I will get a series with her going on. Like maybe like a Soul Link, but a wedding version. Maybe me and her will do a Soul Link together one day. But the thing is, she do she barely plays Pokemon and she do doesn't. She knows what Nuzlocke is, but she'd probably suck at it. So, uh... I'll probably do a series with her, but don't expect us to win. And the series will be pretty much me playing both games. She'll be the one controlling the character, but I'll probably be the one to actually uh, be like helping her out when it comes to battles and stuff. Alright, May, show me what you got. We're going to battle May before we go and take on the next gym. But yeah, I'm down for this. Two gyms, one episode. I'm down. Let's do it.
That's probably how the speedrunners do it, eh? Two gyms within like 10 minutes of each other. They go ham there. Oh, I splashed. No, this is a bad idea because now she's going to defense grow, right? Yeah. Oh, wait. All of my mons are special attackers. So, it's okay. I'm going to head into Smashed. Because if I, if I need one mon higher leveled than the rest, it is Smashed. Smash is going to be our saving grace. I need a question of the day for today's episode. We are 20 minutes in. We don't even have a question of the day. Um, question of the day is going to be... So I mentioned a collab with my girlfriend. Um, do I do a question today about that? I'll do a question today about this because this is something... Or I'm going to talk about this and... Maybe I can get a question of the day out of this. So I am considering making a Discord group for small YouTubers. Not small YouTubers. I'm, I want to make a Discord group for PokeTubers. And it can be anyone from small to large. And it's just a place where all of us can come talk, give each other tips, and maybe plan collabs. So I've been looking on... I've been trying to find one online, and I can't find anyone. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to make one. Uh, but I'm not sure. Let me know down below. I don't know if that's going to be the question of the day, if if it's just going to be, let me know if you'd be interested in something like that. You got a crit. What the heck? Um, I don't know if the question of the day is just going to be, let me know if you're interested in a Discord group like that. But like, let me know if you are interested in the comments down below. That's one thing. Um, I guess second thing would, what's the second thing? I don't know. One more water gun is going to kill. So that's beautiful. Um, but yeah, so I just want... I'm thinking about making a Discord for PokeTubers, small or large. A place where we can come, drop tips. Um, maybe ask people for, for commissions. So, like, even if you're not a YouTuber, if you're somebody that does graphic design or anything, hop in too. Because this could be a place where we can be like, yo, I need this as a design as a, for a layout. Send me... Send me how much it would cost you to make it, blah, blah, blah. So, like, a commission section. And, like, yeah. So, like, for advice, commission, finding a collab partner. Because that's something I really want to do. I want to make a collab. So, I was talking about a soul link with my girlfriend. But before that, like, that's a future idea. Not right now. Um, like I said, I don't record unless nobody's home. So... Like, getting my girlfriend here and nobody home, that would be hard to do. Um, so, yeah. But I am looking for a collab partner. If I found a collab partner, I'd still work when nobody's home. Uh, even when people are home, they'll work. I'd probably work at night, like, when people are asleep. Or if I got a door, which I am planning on doing. I would like to get a door because I would like to also start streaming. So, a door would be nice. Um, yeah, so let me know down below what your thoughts would be on a Discord group for PokeTubers, small to large. I'm sure it would mostly consist of small PokeTubers, and we can grow together. It would almost be like a little group. We, all, we also could drop our channels, drop our latest videos, like we'd have a plug section too. So it wouldn't just be all about like one thing. Alright, we're going to pop a heal first, uh, grab our... Good rod and then skedaddle. But yeah, let me know your that's gonna be the question today. Let me know your thoughts about a PokeTuber Discord group. Um and would you be interested in joining? The Discord group would be pretty much open to anyone, anyone and everyone, uh people who already have a channel or people who are looking to start one. Um Yeah, like right now I was I was in a uh live stream yesterday of a YouTuber. And I was talking to one of the girls in the live stream, in the chat, and she's looking to start a YouTube channel. But she's a little nervous. So, like, this would be the place for those people. The place to find tips, editing tips, maybe somebody that will help them out and teach them how to edit. Like me, I don't know how to edit. <laughs> uh, I know the basics. I'm not going to go and, like, ask somebody in the Dark Card group, Yo, dude, can you come and totally teach me how to edit? No, uh, during my winter break, I've already mentioned this. I want to learn how to get better at editing in my layout. But, like, it could be a good place to get tips for editing. Like, yo, dude, you look like you do that so quick. 
how do you manage that type of thing it could be a cool place for it's a it would be a cool place for poketubers to get together talk relate uh just discuss some ideas back and forth like if somebody has a new nuzlocke type idea but like they want to they want to make it better they don't know how to make it better they know they need to improve it but they don't know how this could be the place to come and talk about it talk about it like hopefully everybody would be secret will keep the secrecy I'll probably make group rules and if you break one of the rules then you're gonna be out like if somebody trusts you with confidential information about like their channel like not I'm not saying passwords don't be sharing passwords but like they talk about a new nuzlocke type idea that they want to do do not steal it before they have a chance to do it type of thing that would kind of be a really shitty thing to do but that would be one of the rules don't steal somebody's lock type idea before they actually go through with it or unless you have it unless you have permission like you could go ask permission to do it if they say yes then do it or be like yo would you want to do that as a co-op if you really like their nuzlocke idea do it as a co-op together that would be sick like this is a place to find collabs and personally in my opinion i find collabs do so much better than just regular playthroughs uh solos like i would have loved to start my entire channel with just a collab which is what i would i would like to have a collab soon um which is another reason but me totally wanting to do this um wanting to do this uh why can't i think uh this discord group um because i've talked to a couple youtubers and a couple of them are nervous um a couple of them just want advice about how to like really pick up their channel and like how to make sure they're doing it properly and like if we get a small group together we could all talk about like what's doing well what's not doing well what can we improve on in our videos and stuff rather than just talking through the comment section and it could be a place we can go to just yeah you know the spiel but yeah, let me know your thoughts on it in the comments down below. I'm actually probably going to create a Discord group for it tonight. Um, whether it picks up or not is a different question. But yeah, so actually probably as of you guys watching this video, it's Friday when this video is going live. The Discord group will for sure be up and um, live. Will there be anybody in it? I doubt it. Um because this is the first I'm going to be mentioning it to anyone. So I'll be in it. Maybe a friend of mine will join too. I'm not sure though. Hey, can we land a water gun? Thank you. Oh, that's not doing much. Um. Splash. And then we're going to swap you with Mewtwo. Just so Mewtwo could come in and one hit this clan pro. Um. Yeah, so don't join it and leave right away. Don't join it and be like, oh, there's only one person here. I'm out. Stick around for a bit. You might be the first one to come in, but you're not you might not be the last. Tr stay in for like a week or two. See what happens, and we will see where it goes from there. I'm probably going to plug the Discord like at the beginning of every channel, uh, at the beginning of every video or something. Be like, yo guys, remember I made a Discord. Go check it out. It's in the comments down below. Now, let's get into today's video. Type of thing. Uh, potion. I'm going to potion in case like I come across a mon with pursuit. I want it ending my career. But yeah. So we are at about 27 minutes. We're going to take on this gym and that's going to be the end of the episode. But we are going to have two gym battles in one episode without speed up, without speed running. Because <laughs> I am definitely not a speed runner. Would I ever love to try speed running? Absolutely. Will it ever happen? Probably not. Um, but my best ch chance at speed running a game would probably be this game. This is the game I've played the most in my life, so this would probably be my best chance at speedrunning. Either this or Fire Red and Leaf Green. I 
I'd say I'm pretty decent at knowing where to go. Actually, besides the Team Rocket hideouts, I suck at the Team Rocket hideouts. That's a big thing. Do Fire Red and uh, Red and Blue would probably be my best. If I do a plain trial. Then so you can get you get a soda pop or something and just skip like half the thing. Or the Poke Doll. And skip all of that too. Yeah. Alright, what are we doing here? We are not splashing, we're gonna swap. I really Ooh, Rattle gets tackle on one level, so soon we could actually leave him in against easier Pokemon. Pokemon that I think it's worth leaving him in for. Oh, my phone just slid right under my butt. I like to keep my phone in between my legs during recordings just in case anything happens, like, or in case I get a text message because my phone's on vibrate. So, that would be the best way for me to know. Or if I leave it on the desk, then it goes and, like, vibrates my entire desk and messes up my mic a little. So that kind of sucks. But, um, yeah, so I generally leave it between my legs, so then I just move a little, and it just went down my butt. Which is kind of okay, but, yeah, I don't want it vi I don't want to leave it there, and then I get a text message, and it vibrates my butt. I don't think that would be the greatest feeling in the world. Probably not, probably not. At least not for me, in my opinion. No. I'm, uh, I'm okay. With not having anything vibrate against my butt. There's one more trainer, right? Yeah, this person. And then that's it. And then all we've got left is Brawly. Two badges, one episode. This is going to be fantastic. Let's hope we don't lose it. Alright, give me the Jirachi here rather than in gym battle. I'm okay with that. I'm very okay with that. I don't want to battle no high level Jirachi. I'll take your level 13 Jirachi. No problem. Right, what are we doing? What is that? Don't all oh, you wished? Yeah, and you're gonna get this all back. Okay, now your wish was rendered useless. Don't have like the okay. I was real afraid that they were gonna have the berry to like wake yourself up. That would suck. Oh, yeah, big sleep, big sleep. Okay, three turn sleep, three turn sleep. Swear to God, if this Jirachi wakes up and goes for rest. Okay. Triggered. We need the crit. Oh. Beauty. She didn't go for rest. And that's game. Oh, yeah. Jirachi can be such a pain, especially with the rest spam. If you can't do big damage and then they just rest spam, that's so annoying. 298. Ooh, almost at level 18. Yeah, our levels are perfectly fine for this gym battle. It triggered full. If this guy has a Magikarp, we're doing Magikarp v Magikarp. Let's go. Brawly, I'm here to take you on. Let's get it. Of course I want to challenge you. Show me what you got, buddy. Let's go. Let's fight. Need a ran. Alright, okay. Okay. I might even be able to tackle you here. Let's go for a tackle, see what you got. Oh, yeah, no. Never mind. You're coming out. Uh, I thought tackle would do a little bit more than that. We can do scratch me. Huh. That barely made a dent. That barely left a scratch. That's what I should have said. Not that barely made a dent. That's one Mon down. Alright, who's next? Who's next? Vibrava. Hopefully it's not as good as the one I had in my last one. Because Vibrava in the last season had Wonder Guard. So if this guy has Wonder Guard, this will be a very big issue. Swap back into Smashed. Let's get it. What are you going to go for? You're going to go for... Oh, yeah. You have a lot of Dark-type moves. I didn't think about that. Ah, oh, that's nothing. And I don't even think you have Santum yet. 
We're good. And this is going to be a two shot. Oh, I was wrong. It's a one shot. <laughs> All right. Who's next? Cradley. We're going to go into Rattled. Um, He's Grass and Rock. Cradley? Isn't it Crad... It's Cradley. Cradley? Cradley? Whatever. Uh, no. He's Grass and Rock. So, even though I think water is super effective... No, water is neutral on him. I'm still going to go into Mewtwo. Oh, you're going to be a pain. You're the ace, too. Confusion. Who's a stoner? Oh, I don't like that. Astonish Ingrain? No. Okay, that's what we're going to do. We're going to get rid of his Astonish. Yeah, and he just went for Astonish, right? Yeah. You're going to go for Confusion now. I'm actually going to set up a barrier. Barrier. Yo, what? Astonish isn't disabled anymore? What is that? Yo, why isn't this... I didn't see Astonish is no longer disabled. I thought Astonish disables for, uh... For five turns. What is this? Barrier, let's raise it again. Um, do I go for another barrier? Let's go for another barrier. Get our defenses all the way up. So ghost and his ghost and poison moves aren't gonna do anything. I sharply rose it three times now. I think that means I am at, um... Uh, I'm at plus six, so that's the highest I'm gonna be able to go. Sorry, my voice got really nasally for a second there. I had to, like, scratch my nose almost, and it just got really nasally. Um... Confusion. Yo, that's gonna take so long. I really wish I had an X special attack or something. Alright, we got him into the yellows now, but he's gonna heal and get back into the green, right? Pokemon is so annoying. I wish I had a fighting type move. Alright. I think we won. We won. He has an orion berry. He's a citrus berry. Oh my god. I have to heal because if he gets a crit, I'm dead. Okay, what do we got here? We've got direct hit, ups to critical hit ratio. Yeah, we're going to super potion. See what I said? He's getting back to full. I'm gonna direct hit. Um, I'm gonna confusion. All right. I feel like that's doing loss. I have to heal in case of the crit. Super potion. This battle is so annoying. I should have gotten some encounters first. 
see this just because of this creatively it's adding 10 minutes to my video this video should have been done in like 35 uh, 33 35 minutes and now it's gonna be done in like 45 you get some long you get some long episodes here it's slightly salt okay I mean hey if you're enjoying the content then it's not bad I know my today uh, I just woke up today so like my I know my blah, 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 I know my commentary is not on point there's been a lot of uh, moments that I've been mute which I know it kind of sucks but um yeah <laughs> hopefully the next episode I won't be as mute I'll figure out something to say I'm probably gonna go eat something in between episodes and uh, come back hard for the next encounter filled episode this next episode all it is gonna be is encounters I get my four encounters here we do the cave go to go to slate port two encounters on the beach alone because I have the beach encounter and then I have the uh, slate port city encounter because if you go to the top of the beach and go to left it considers you in slate port he has a super potion Oh my god. It's considered Slateport, so we're gonna get an encounter there. And then we have an encounter just above Slateport, too. So it is gonna be confused. It is gonna be encounter filled. Just there alone, there's seven encounters. And then after that episode, I'm probably gonna have to train up the new squad. Yeah. That'll probably be the play. How did it confuse itself? I forget. Oh, confusion. Right, I've conf moved confusion. Now there's a chance to confuse the target. Alright, kill, kill. I used direct hit. Did we ever get a crit? Okay, one more kill. Thank God he didn't get a crit there, eh? Oy vey. Guys, we're almost out of confusions. Finally! But I have to heal now. We have five more confusions. This is not good. Is he out of astonishes though? Because he's going for he's going for constrict now. So even even he's in a problem situation. Oh, cradle he's almost taken on is taken on a Mewtwo though. That sucks. Yeah, I think upping your crit hit ratio lowered it. Get a crit. Of course not. Going for acid. Yeah, he's for sure out of astonishes. Okay. It should only be one more confusion, right? Yes. Ooh. Level 18 on Mewtwo. Get some decent EXP there. Probably because it was such a hard battle. Beauty. That's going to be it for Brawly, and we are going to grab this gym badge right now. Yeah, let's add that to, let's add that badge to layout. That was, that was a bad oh, snap too. I don't even know if you guys heard it. What are we giving? Give me something powerful. TM08, what are we getting? What are we getting? Hydro Pop! Yo, that's no, no doubt about it. Is Gyarados a special attacker? Who can learn it? Who can learn it? Bag. DMs. Hydro Pump. Use. Rattled's not able to learn it. That sucks. I wonder if it keeps it... If it keeps that thing for Magikarp though. I wonder if there's a thing in the system... So that Magikarp still can't uh, learn TMs, even if it is preferred typing. Alright, well that's going to be it for today's episode, guys. I really hope you did enjoy. 
answer the question of the day what do you guys think about a discord group for poketubers small or large uh let me know what your opinions are on that and if you are interested in joining that uh discord chat hit uh look in the comments down below it's gonna be with all my social media it's probably gonna be above all my social media it's gonna be the discord group uh i hope you guys did enjoy the video and if you did hit that like button and i'll catch you guys in the next one stay salty